Readiness. They are ready. They are ready to live. Ready to live. Amen? You know, ready for what? For the coming of the Lord. Amen? Hallelujah. Ready to save the souls. Ready to preach the word of God. Ready, Lord, I'm ready. I'm tucked, Lord. No more I'm going to sit. Lord, use me. I'm ready. I need the power of God. I need the anointing. Lord, I'm ready. I'm ready. They have the sandals on. Ready for the work of God. For us, we work only when things are good. We have this, we have, I, I don't have time to waste on that. You know what, how people work. If they don't have something in the uh, church, they don't go to the church. If they don't have something to important, then no, 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 no. It's all good. But there is something, you got to work for the kingdom of God. Amen, hallelujah. And when you tie it, nothing will fall and tangle it. You know, without getting caught, without getting entangled, you got to keep your garment ready to run for God. Amen. Hallelujah. That's what it means. Right? Determination. Determination and focus as a Christian. And Claude talks about the power of God. When the woman came and touched the hem of the garment of Jesus, the power went. Amen. Hallelujah. Do you have power in you? The power of God, the anointing of God. You, your body is a clock. Your body is a That's why right, it's a garment of salvation. Isn't it? When you, when you come into the baptism, you're clothed with Christ. That means you're clothed. You're clothed. In the olden days, in the Old Testament, Israel had a clock. But today, my clock is Jesus himself. Amen. Hallelujah. When I'm baptized, you know what is the meaning of baptism? When I'm baptized, I am clothed with Christ. This is Christ. I'm clothed with Christ when I'm baptized. That's the reason everything is covered. My sin is covered. My guilt is covered. My everything is covered. What is seen outside of me is a Christ. And when I really touch this, there is the healing. Amen. The power of a believer. Your clock. Ready. You must be determined. You must be focused to go. No time. People are patient. Lord, no time. Send me. Lord, I'm ready. I tap my clock. You know, Ben talks about the truth. Ephesians chapter. Paul talks about the armor of God. The Ben talks about the truth. The truth is nothing but Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. I am the way, the truth, and the life. That's what he said, right? The truth. You've got to have truth of Jesus and ready to go to the destination. Amen. Hallelujah. The minute you come into the salvation, God shows you the destiny. May not know the details. Doesn't matter. I don't care about the details as long as God is with me. Amen. Hallelujah. That's what Moses said. If you don't, if you don't come with us, we don't go. Amen. Hallelujah. Am I right? If you don't come with us, we don't go. We want you to come. That's a matter where all. Maybe wilderness, maybe war, maybe Red Sea. Doesn't matter. I know the destiny of God. Amen. Hallelujah. The minute you come, when you wear the clock, you know the destiny. Determined, focused. That's what talks about the garment. And when God wants to choose Aaron and his family, and he told Moses to anoint the garment. Amen. Hallelujah. Today, you and me are priests. Amen. Hallelujah. Are your garments anointed today? Are your garments have the power? That means you. I'm talking you. You are in clothed with Christ. That's how you have to eat this meal. Glory be to God.